Right, so first thing I want to say about corner building is that any of you youngsters out there, you need to know that a good corner builder will not outlay someone who's good with their profiles. If the maximum amount of money you can earn in a day is what you are trying to achieve, then profiles are the way to go. <clears throat> now, to get a 12 high corner, you need to go six bricks one way, six bricks the other, or if you need a 10 high corner, you'll go five one, five the other, or if it's seven, you'll go four and then three, uh, but you'll go four the way that you're starting, so this will be the way that you're starting, like this, this will be the way you're starting, so you'll go four that way and three the other. That's how you'll hit your, that's how you hit the number, the, the heights that you need to, that you want to hit. Um, I just want to, I'm going to go through the motion that you want to be going for. Um, your technique and everything, that's a whole different ball category, but when you're laying semi-engineerings like this, you do not need to V your bed out. Um, if you lay a consistently thick bed, um, most of the muck comes up through the middle and down in the middle. You don't get a lot come out either side. And when you're pushing your brick down, so that it doesn't, much doesn't go out the back, you'll slightly push down more of, I'll, I'll over exaggerate it, but you're pushing down more like this and squeezing across. Um, and it'll, it'll get mo most of the muck out the front if there is gonna be a lot of muck. So, as well, the trowel, I do not recommend using a 13 inch, 13 inch trowel. I'm using this for a different reason, uh, other than, you know, I, I don't, an 11 inch trowel is the biggest anyone should ever use. Otherwise you're gonna be causing yourself more problems than not. Uh, long term, you're gonna be causing yourself a lot of problems. Tom, Ollie, I want this first course put round of block work on the inside. Wall ties, reset them out, 750s, yeah? If you pencil mark the 750s onto the wall pe uh, block brickwork first, then you'll know you haven't moved them, yeah? Uh, right, so anyway, I'm gonna get to it. So first thing you wanna be doing is, um, to be efficient at it, you need to be coming from this way round to this way. And you concentrate on your bed first so that you keep that motion going. All right, so you've got your bed done. You'll walk back round to this side. You wanna leave your level somewhere around this area, leave it there. Um, and then you wanna concentrate. First one you wanna lay so that you get a feel for how much you've got to push the brick down. So that is bang on there. So I always start from this way and go round that way. Uh, and I'll eye the arras down across that way. We'll go through. He's pushed down very easy, so it's more like mu me uh, muscle memory when you're pushing down for each brick, and each brick that you lay is going to be different uh, depending on how your mucks come up. So you'll go round like this. Can I have some all ties here, please? Pick your snots up as you come back through. 
get your level. You want to range it uh, level across the top first. So a little bit of a tap down there. Come right through to the end. Then come through to this side. Then you want to turn this way up like this and then plumb it up. I turn around this way, plumb it up. And then you range this side through. And then you come around to the side. Plumb it up. Range it through. Level goes back to where it was there. Pick the muck straight back up. And then you go around again. So then you'll come back round to this way. Place where you think it's uh, 150. Just a quick check. I'm ironing down my Aris. Corner one is easiest to eye because I'm going to eye down this side, then eye down this side. Snots, level, across the top. Level across the top. Plumb it up the front. Spin round, plumb it up the front on the corner. Range it through. Plumb up the corner, the end, range it through, You're back to this point, put your level where it goes, back to your muck. Did you grab me some ball ties? Sorry? They can't reset this one. Why? No, no, you leave them. Uh, don't worry about them. Get your wall ties. I won't tell anyone if you don't. Right. So now I need a few more than that though, yeah? Where was I? Level. 
across the top. No, I've got some there. Oh, uh, yeah, that'll do me. Stand the way you're facing. Plumb it up. Spin round. Plumb it up. Range it through. Plumb it up. In the end. See, I'm not going from down here because there's a slight kick there, which is quite common for the soldiers. So you want to go from the top point that the, la the line was last run into. Because if you go down here like this, and then plumb it from a point that's sticking out slightly, when you run over, you're going to have a lip over this brick. So if, if you're ever struggling to find a point to plumb from, because it's a bit all over the shop, it's not too bad to be fair, but you always plumb from your top last coarse brick laid. And if you hit your level, hit it with your flat side, your um, flat side, not your blade. Small muck, please. Now I've got my wall ties, I'll go back and put the wall ties through as well. On. Always have your tape on your side. You ain't looking for it every two seconds. Every time you put it down. Where's uh, Tyler? Going to get a uh, water. Oh, is he? All right. What tub? The um, boards. Well, you don't need it through here, do you? No, oh, you, well, you can see you can use these boards, can't you? No, yeah, but you don't need the block cutter for through here, do you? No, yeah, but you've still got one course to lay through here, and that's solid, isn't it? Yeah, let's just get started through there, yeah?
There's no backup map, please, Tom. Another one for here. And then another one for here. Yeah. I'm gauged to where I am, so I'll just start again now, 75. Ah, uh, nah, it's all I can get the wall ties, can't I? You, 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 you. <laughs> even Ollie, Ollie, do you want to go and get the wall ties for us? Do you know where they are?
It's at a height now, it's just very easy to level with your eye, so. I won't bother using a level to the end now. Honestly, mate, just yeah, yeah. You're gonna have to put a cut in this way first, though, yeah, and then a 200 mil bit in there. All right. I've got a six foot, uh, and it's good just to stick it through and range it through there, just to. Lovely. That's how you build a corner. Also, what I want to say is, when you're building corners, don't be taking them up 24 courses because you'll be there forever. Um, you build a small corner like this, 12 high, go to the other end, build a small corner, run in a section, go to the next corner, run in the other section, go to the next corner, run in the other section, then, and then run this section in, and then you go around again on the in, uh, go around again. Uh, otherwise, it becomes very inefficient if you don't, if you're going to build 24 high, uh, 21 high corners. And there you have it. 